This is the daily video update for Thursday, October 14th, 2021 for the Unitarian Church of Lincoln. I am the Reverend Oscar Sinclair. Yesterday, the Faith Coalition of Lancaster County, um, which I lead this year, sat down with the Lincoln Lancaster County Health Department to talk through where we are in the pandemic and what the best practices right now in churches are. That conversation was wide ranging and you can see it in full at this link, but there are two things that are important to highlight from that conversation. First, vaccinations and masks in combination are a really powerful tool. In response to almost every question we asked the health department, the response was make sure everyone is wearing a mask. So how do we think about intergenerational interaction? Make sure everybody who's wearing a mask first. How do we navigate risk in our community? Make sure everyone is wearing a mask. What can churches do to help the broader public health effort to end the pandemic? Make sure everyone at large gatherings is wearing a mask. So we're going to do that and we're going to continue to do everything we can do to get as many folks vaccinated as possible. The piece that followed though in that conversation was a little unexpected. Within the context of a church service, where everyone is wearing a mask, it appears that singing is less risky than we once thought. Many churches in Lincoln and Lancaster County have continued to meet throughout the pandemic, and the health department here has not tracked a single case of COVID-19 transmission by singing while masked. So what does that mean? Yesterday, I met with our music director, our choir director, and the board, and we are in full agreement. When we meet this Sunday, when we gather in person for the first time in a few months, we will sing hymns together for the first time since March of 2020. We'll keep our masks on while the risk dial is in yellow, and we'll keep doing different mitigation measures for the next couple weeks, but those measures are and will continue to be guided by the best advice we have from our trusted partners in public health. And when that advice evolves, like it has on singing, so too will our plans. Singing is a really big deal. For me, it is the loss that I have felt most in these last couple months. So this is a really big step and it's a really exciting step to make church feel like church. Anyway, see you tomorrow and see you on Sunday.